Hi everyone, I'm Tanya J. Peterson with the Anxiety Show Anxiety blog on HealthyPlace.com. Panic attacks can leave us feeling terrible, really unsettled, shaky, those lingering symptoms, and a lot of times more anxious even than before, or at least just as anxious. Uh, they can leave us being really hard on ourselves, berating ourselves for having that panic attack, and just all these things that can keep us revved up while at the same time feeling exhausted. So here are five steps that you can take immediately following a panic attack to help center your thoughts and your feelings and your body. Get yourself physically and mentally reset. So first step, number one, just close your eyes or if you don't feel comfortable closing your eyes, just kind of keep your gaze soft, maybe down at a, at a point, but don't be looking at something. Just soften your gaze, close your eyes, and take a few slow, deep breaths. This actually speeds the recovery process. It lowers your heart rate and your blood pressure, and it gets those, let's say it just slows everything. It reduces the, hor the, hormone, the hormones, cortisol and adrenaline. It just helps settle you down. So number one, close your eyes or gaze softly and just breathe. And number two, rather than berating yourself for having had a panic attack or keeping those thoughts going and, and hard on yourself and focused on, you know, why is my, my heart so racing? And why am I doing this? Or, you know, I'm so this and this and that, and these negative labels that you put on yourself. Thank yourself. A shift to an attitude of gratitude. Really, a panic attack is your brain and body's way of trying to keep you safe. A lot of times it is misguided and it ends up causing more problems than it solves, but it's still an attempt to keep you safe. So second step, after you breathe, just express gratitude, express thanks. Thank you, body, thank you, brain, for trying to keep me safe. Then number three, pull yourself into the present and remind yourself. You usually after a panic attack have to actively remind yourself that you are safe, that things are okay. So three, repeat a simple statement. I am safe right now in this moment, or just I am okay. So number one, you breathe. Two, instead of being hard on yourself, be grateful. Thank your body and brain for trying to keep you safe. And three, remind yourself, I am safe right now. I am okay. And then number four, calm your thoughts. Choose a focus object. Choose something to be present with in that moment. It could be something you have in your pocket. It could be... Um, my, my computer mouse. So I grab this, something that's close by or something that you notice, something on the wall or in the distance, uh, my fish, something like that. You pick any object, neutral is good, and just focus your thoughts on that instead of where they are racing all over the place post panic attack. So the color, the texture, how does it feel? Does it make any sounds? What does it, does it have a smell? No, hopefully not. Hopefully this, this doesn't. But does, does something have a smell? Yes or no? Just study the qualities and keep your thoughts there. And when they start racing off in panic, just bring them back mindfully to your focus object, whatever it is. And then finally, number five, return to that breath and just breathe slowly and deeply while you let your body in your brain even out again. So those are five things you can do. Repeat them as needed. Folks, stay with one longer than the others. Whatever works for you to return to that sense of calm after a panic attack. Thank you for listening, and I'll see you next time.